टूडे उइ डिसकस्ड अबाउट प्रोटेक्शन एगेंस्ट ओभार भोल्टेज ह्वाट इज द कज टू प्रड्यूसड ओभार भोल्टेज इज मेनलि फर लाइटनींग ओपेंग अफ ए सार्किट ब्रेकार ग्राउंडिंग अफ ए कंडक्टर नाउ उइ डिसकस्ड अबाउट भोल्टेज सार्च ह्वाट इज भोल्टेज सार्च ए सार्डन राइज इन भोल्टेज फर ए भेरि शर्ट ड्यूरेशन अफ टाइम अन ए पावर सिसटेम इज नोन एज भोल्टेज सार्च और ट्रांजियंट भोल्टेज इट इज अल्सो कल द ट्रांजियंट भोल्टेज हियर यू कैन सी ए ग्राफ दिस ग्राफ इज शोईंग हियर द ट्रांजियंट भोल्टेज साडनलि द भोल्टेज सार्ज और something lightning or something grounding something opening of the circuit breaker whatever it is happened in the line so the voltage of the line uh, suppose the voltage of the line is e and the voltage of the line is just get some higher magnitude like this wave from is a wave front and wave tail this is the wave front and wave tail so t1 t1 is the rising time it is the time for beginning it is the time from the beginning of the surge to the peak value it is the time uh, for beginning to peak value it is the time of rising time and this is the decay time so t2 is the decay time total total decay time the um, beginning to peak value peak value to um, half of the Uh, peak value half of the peak value if we consider that 1 by 50 microsecond surge means what is the means of the 1 by 50 microsecond surge is uh, it means that the reach its maximum value the surge reach its maximum value in 1 microsecond and decay to half its maximum value of its peak peak value whatever it is peak value is 50 microsecond so it is the main funda of voltage surge and what is the cause of voltage surge the voltage surge may be caused by the internal causes or be maybe the external causes what is the um, internal causes internal causes is the for switching for insulation failure for arcing ground for resonance and external causes what is the external causes external causes is only for the lightning lightning uh, for the lightning uh, for internal causes uh, the apparatus or the equipment uh, is not very uh, is not um, uh, this is not very harmful effect but external causes is very harmful and very dangerous effect on the uh, device so we have to use some protective device against the external causes internal causes by help of some um instruments we can minimize the uh, surges but for the external causes the voltage peak or magnitude uh, is higher than the internal causes so external causes uh, we, we we have to um, ignore the external causes by uh, providing some um, protective in instruments against the external causes or lightning so uh, for discussing about the over voltage we have to discuss about the inductive reactance and capacitive reactance this is the formula xl is the 2 pi fl is the um, inductive reactance and this is the capacitive reactance xl equal to 1 by 2 pi fc it is also important um, in case of the voltage peak if we discuss about lightning what is lightning an electric discharge between cloud to earth between clouds or between the charge center of the same clouds is known as lightning lightning is a huge spark and take place when clouds are charged to such a higher potential may be positive may be negative the uh, high uh, mane big drops of the waters that accumulates in the cloud is contain the positive charges and the small drops contain the negative charges negative charges so um, this is the lightning 
to protect the uh, transmission systems or to protect the substations from the lightning or the traveling web what is the traveling web traveling web is nothing when you are just opening a circuit breaker or just opening a isolators in in normal cases some web from in in normal cases the, suppose it is a isolators in closed conditions and this is the isolators in open conditions open condition this is the closed condition this is the open condition in closed conditions suppose the voltage source uh, is connected to this point and the web from the web from of the voltage is just as like as this when you are just opening opening it some web from is just remaining here and the web from is cutting from here so this uh, web from of the um, voltage is remain on the systems doubling wave and this doubling wave uh, will affect the voltage increase voltage magnitude will be increased this is the traveling wave traveling wave and what is the um, lightning we have already discussed what is the lightning for protection of the lightning uh, we use the lightning arresters in the substations or in transmission line what is the lightning arresters a lightning arresters or a surge diverter is a protective device which conducts the high voltage surge on power system to the ground we draw a lightning arresters here this is the power line we have to write here this is the power line we um, directly connect the lighting arresters one terminal to the power ground and other terminal to the earth in between these we used a resistance and this is the spark gap this is the spark gap and what is the type of lighting arrester the rod gap lighting arresters horn gap lighting arresters multi gap lighting arrester expulsion type lighting arresters and valve type lighting arresters now we discussed about the lighting arresters lighting arresters one end of the lighting arresters or diverter is connected to the terminal of the equipment to be protected and the other end is effectively grounded the length of the gap the length of the gap is so set that the normal line voltage is not enough to cause the arc across the gap but a dangerously high voltage but a dangerously high voltage will break down dangerously high voltage will break down the arc insulation and from an arc the property of nonlinear resistor is that its resistance decreases its resistance decreases as the voltage increases as the voltage increases as the voltage increases its resistance decreases so uh, what is the action of the lighting arresters what is the action of the lighting arresters under normal condition under normal operation the lighting arresters is off in the line it's conduct no current to earth no current to earth or the gap is non conducting on occurrence of over voltage the air insulation across the gap break down and an arc is found and providing a low resistance path low resistance um, path for the surge to the ground in this way the excess charge on the line due to the surge is harmlessly conducted through the arresters to the ground instead of bring set back to set back over the line it is worthwhile to mention the function of nonlinear resistor in the operation of the arrester as the gap uh, spark over due to over voltage the arc would be a short circuit on the power systems and may cause the power flow current in the arresters since the characteristics of the resistors is to often higher resistor resistance to high voltage it's prevent the effect 
of a short circuit after the surge is over the resistors offer the high resistance to make the gap non conducting so uh, you have to remember that during the normal operations this gap this gap uh, non conducting and in case of the high voltage or surge uh, is just injecting to the line or surge is just coming to the line this conducting air uh, air uh, conducting material will be break and the high voltage and uh, will be passed through this and then the if the voltage will be higher if the voltage will be higher the resistance will be lower the low resistance path will be uh, this is the low will be the low resistance path so the uh, extra charges will be grounded so uh, this extra charges will not be injected to the line this if the line is coming uh, from to this direction and to direction so extra charges is grounded here and then the normal voltage will be go to this directions so friend um, today we discussed about the protection against the over voltage what is the causes of over voltage and how we minimize the over voltage in case of the applications as um, in the substations in the transmissions line in the transformers in the generators uh, so friend um, if you like my video please share it and subscribe my channel thank you